I think that you know the KD Steenberg Classic is a, is a combination of of of, of a, really a, a South African company and a, a golf course that's based in Constantia, and we really want to be seen to be giving back to the community, and you know we we we, we live locally. We 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 have a lot of people who play golf here, a lot of people who work on the estate, and there are lots of people you know within the area that are direct kind of either beneficiaries or descendants or people who are related to people who work or play here, and to be able to really you know do what we can um, to make as much impact as some of the big events and uh, you know that that are around and, and ready to to make an immediate impact on the people in the direct area and I think that's that's unique and if we could have more of that then yeah we'd all be in a better place. I was called out yesterday afternoon to collect this dog from the township. Somebody had seen her in a terrible state and while I was there, somebody pointed out this one to me. She's, she is so traumatized, she's obviously been so abused. She, when I caught her, she just screamed and screamed and screamed and tried to bite me, but I managed to get a rope, a, a rope lead around her neck and secure her and put her in the box. But she's so traumatized, she's got mange, she's emaciated, She's had numerous litters of puppies during her life, you can see. So now she'll come in here and be treated, sterilized, rehabilitated, and then we'll find a home for her. Tears is a pro-life non-profit organization whose core aim is to rescue, rehabilitate, reunite, and rehome lost, abandoned, and abused, neglected dogs and cats. So I can assure you that this wonderful donation is very from Cady's and from Steenburg Golf Club will greatly assist us in our work, and we, we thank you so much. Our particular focus here, um, immediately behind me, is the Emmanuel Educare Centre, which is a preschool from grade naught to grade R. Uh, we accommodate up to 180 children here. Our understanding is that there's nothing more important for us to do than to educate our people in this country. And it's got to start right at the beginning with our preschool. And so we have now extended this preschool to have six classrooms uh, so we can accommodate these 180 children. And the funding has come from various sources, including uh, Steenberg Golf Estate, uh, which has been assisted by Cadiz in this respect. And so we, the funds that we've received today have gone towards the building of this preschool and the extensions that we've now completed. One wonders, you know, disabled riding, how can disabled people ride? And yet this riding is so incredible for them. You get them up on a horse and from a wheelchair onto a horse, they're suddenly looking down on everyone and they can move as fast as everyone, which is so great for their esteem. As you saw when they got on the horses this morning, the smiles and doing all the exercises. In six months, a child who's very low muscle toned, the back will have strengthened sufficiently for them to sit unaided. And in fact, one step from a horse is eight large body movements. So the child is getting rotation, flexation, everything. And as you hear, they're now steering their horses and stopping them. We don't give pony rides, we actually teach them how to ride. So now they're stopping their horses, they've got to start them, they've got to steer them. And as I say, for a child to be in control of a big animal like this, it's really, it's wonderful for them. From Cadis, this donation is incredible. It's really helping us. Say so these horses eat a lot, and this is now going to help our financial situation because we do not charge for the lessons at all. This is all free therapy that we give into these children. And as you know, horses are expensive things.
the, the Stenberg caddies, it's obviously an integral part of the club and uh, we give that money so especially times like, uh, like in winter when the, the guys are struggling for work because obviously in Cape Town we have some uh, torrential downpours, uh, we give them money uh, on the side, we also give them uh, some caddy packs which is food, we uh, really value what they do for us, they provide a great service to our members and to our guests and visitors alike and we also uh, it helps fund them with our clinic, you know, the guys get sick throughout the year, we give them free medical um, advice and, uh, and, and, and care and we, we look after the guys as best we can. The donation from Katie's is going to go a long way, we really appreciate it and thanks to Katie's for their continued support of Stenberg and Stenberg Classic as well as our caddies. We look to uh, change the lives uh, and improve the lives of people with bleeding conditions uh, so throughout South Africa no matter where they live. Um, the check uh, will make a huge difference in people with bleeding conditions. Uh, it will help uh, for us to procure uh, things like wheelchairs uh, to basically uh, improve the quality of lives in terms of the mobility that they've got because uh, haemophilia affects the joints um, and therefore reduces mobility eventually. Um, also through our partnership um, and our um, uh, arrangement with Katie's, the Cadiz Foundation, we wish to thank them for their continued support of the South African Haemophilia Society um, for making a difference in people's lives. And, uh, I think like, like anyone basically when you do well it's very important to give back to the community and we're doing this like everyone else and we decided to differentiate ourselves uh, in the sense that one of the things that I like it's not, we're not in a check writing business. The, the issue is to get everyone to roll their sleeves and to get involved in giving back to the community. So many things that we do, like the Steinberg Classics, like the Freedom Swim event that we do, there's always a giving back to the community element behind this. And we have to get involved and understand what the community is doing and how we're giving back to the community. That's, that's kind of bring, maybe close the gap a little bit in society. You know, we go to work and we're busy sometimes shifting around billions of friends, not ours, clients. Huge responsibility managing dozens of billions for clients. And then when you roll your sleeve and you, and, and you get involved in some of these uh, projects, it just smack you back down to reality and to earth and makes you understand why we're all around.